But I say we get some sleep because tomorrow we're gonna go to Bernico and check out more boats because it is boat building starting time. Yeah, I'm just recording the You're whole time. You're recording? Yeah, of course I am. Brilliant! <laughs> so here we are, and I, look at this, I'm actually measuring a real boat instead of sitting on the grass. <laughs> we are, we're at Bernico, and I mean, I filmed the intro this morning at five in the morning, and now it's 8.30 at night. And I've, I've been meaning to film all day, but we haven't had a second over, because I've been measuring everything you could possibly measure <laughs> on a boat. You did a good job today. I think we've, we've been super productive because when you're sitting on the grass measuring or you're sitting in the computer it's very different from actually being in the boat and this here is actually the this same as the this, hole on the front is exactly the same that we're gonna build so yeah that's what we've been doing all day we've been discussing every stupid idea we could think of and these guys well both of you guys are probably even crazier than I knew before we I came never, here today we've never had a crazy client uh, like yourself so <laughs> I think it's a good combination like yeah, you had the video of the little weird... Uh... The West Watercraft? Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, so check this out. You build everything apparently. Yeah, exactly. So, I don't know, how, how much did we talk about what we were building last time we were here? Basically, we're building something really unique, I would say. Not existing, let's put it that way. It's the project in my life that I spent the most time on, for sure. And how many photos had I sent you? Well, actually, I was watching my phone and in the last three months, you sent me 525 reels. 525 is what I've sent, and that's me trying not to send too many photos your way. You thought it was only 10%. It's okay. Crazy. That's how you create greatness. But now I think I should probably leave you guys alone, but first you guys just have to look at I think you showed the seat last time, but when I was here last time, I didn't know anything about boats, so now I know, I know everything in theory, but not in driving wise. But look at this. I've been staring at photos of these seats, trying to figure out different seat combinations. 180, and we're gonna be at 290. Which is a long way. <laughs> <laughs> so the whole idea is that we're gonna combine the performance this boat has, which is based on the offshore racing hull, but we're gonna make it so that it has the space of a day boat that is usually slow and boring. To summarize the idea. <laughs> yeah. And then we have a lot of power going in the back. More power than this bit. What does this have? Uh, these are two twin 1075s. Yeah. Let's don't, just, let, don't, don't say too much. We won't blow the surprise yet, but yeah. we'll just say that we have a lot more than 2,200 horsepower. Yeah. That's and good. These babies look pretty big already. Six months ago, I would have thought that <laughs> was undrivable, and whoever bought that was a crazy person. Yeah. So now you know who's a crazy person. <laughs> Which is great. Like just today, we've had so many ideas. Because if you can have a boat like this that breaks the speed of light, and you can have a toilet and a, a kitchen and a, a bed. Yanni's gonna be happy. Yeah, it's very important that Yanni's happy. <laughs> you have to think, how can I build the Formula One car for the sea and keep Yanni happy? Because Yanni was not happy in the rebellion that I used to own uh, on the street. But now I'm gonna go back to my hotel and sleep and um, you've been vlogging today as well, right? Yep. Yeah, so if you wanna see more of today, uh, since I was busy using my head for this and you could actually think and do two things at the same time, same then time. you can check out the link in the description to see more from here. Oh uh, yeah, we should probably check in on Benny. I know Benny went to Monaco to pick up a bunch of things and I think he got a delivery. Why don't we, we, we check over to Benny and we'll uh, see you guys tomorrow. Uh, misunderstood on the bed situation up there because they need one and I think there is more than one <laughs> so there is those two boxes this thing that I don't know what it is this I don't know it's pretty heavy these two super heavy more box that is also super long another one that is massively heavy the top of the mattress and this is but this I don't think you can fit upstairs <laughs> I'm a bit confused I, I have no idea what to do with this so I guess I'm gonna leave it here and uh, good luck for you guys when you come back <laughs> Ooh, 
So we're saying good morning from Brussels Airport and unfortunately I have a taxi behind me because I'm not going on a flight because I missed my flight this morning. So I'm going back to Bernico. I've had a shitty shitty morning but I guess that's the benefit of uh, doing filming daily that you guys get to tag along on the good and the bad stuff. Sorry, now I'm done, now we can go. So yeah, change your plans, back to Bernico and see what else we can learn about boats. It's such a slide sometimes. Okay, attempt number two. Let's see if we leave this time. <laughs> I don't want to leave. But it's so sick to see how you're making everything in-house. It's cool, eh? Like steering wheel seats, holes, and uh, metal work, and it, it's all being done. It's all here. Which is uh, why I love being here. But now my battery is blinking dead, so I'm gonna jump in here so that I can recharge uh, everything. But hopefully I won't. Well, maybe I wanna miss, miss my flight, actually. <laughs> then I'm gonna miss my flight towards Indonesia as well, which would not be ideal. I can't explain how excited I am to actually build this boat. But we really should keep going because otherwise you're gonna... No, don't, don't say that. That's gonna stress me. <laughs> More time. No, we have an uh, hour we have 50. Still, that yeah, should yeah, be okay. Right. So last night I was saying that I'll put a mattress on the floor in the, in the factory. Yeah, and I, I can just move in. Kidding. Nope. It's when I get into things, I kind of get really into them. Pretty much. It's like the uh, proper ulcer disease yeah. that I had in my mind <laughs> they, they for should, the last two days already. Yeah, they should diagnose being obsessed with things as the Olsen disease. It's a good disease to have. <laughs> it's a good disease for boats. But it also makes it late to the airport. <laughs> I love everything. Fire spreading all around my room. My world's so bright. It's hard to breathe, but that's all right. Hush. And we are back. We are the all united in Stockholm again. The light is off. Let me put the flash. Huh? Oh, yes. Much better. Now we can start. Good morning. Perfect. Good morning. Good morning. So first of all, sorry for the first part of this vlog being a bit weird because we have done like when you're packing up to leave a place for a long time and you're going to rebuild and then you're all going this way to then connect to then go somewhere makes vlogging difficult. Yes. But now it's kind of like getting more into the rhythm yes. where it's nice. So we're just now waiting for the cab so that we can go Maybe to Arden. Maybe we should go outside. Probably, because yes. we're, we're on time when Jan is. I don't for the weather here. You guys are in sweaters. We're going to where we don't need this. Never I have nothing know. more than this. I have on no the job. boat, if it's going to get cold. It's not going to get cold. Gets cold you know? means that you might need a hoodie. The worst case scenario. Worst case, exactly. But I'm so ready to get a tan and just yes. eat back in the tropics. Join us and come along on this trip towards paradise. First time in the history of the vlog that we're flying Singapore. Oh, really? Yeah, we've never flown Singapore in this vlog. I personally never filmed Singapore. So I I'm very remember excited. it being super epic last time I flew it. So I'm praying to God it's the same thing. Thank you. Hello. Thank you. What did I tell you about the size of the seats? But look, look at the size of the seats. Wow, this is like big. this. This is not first class. This is business, and normally, you, like this is bigger than most first classes. So I'd say I think we should do a little review of, of this. Lombok here, here we come. Yes. How's food? How's the menu? Not anything vegetarian. Vegetarian? Not even. Oh, it's okay. We can ask them to make yeah. some. I'm sure. I'm sure, they have something. We'll but it, it's big as a first class seat. I've never it's seen insane. a big seat like this, and so. I'm prepared. And eye masks. Eye masks. Thank, you. Thank you so much. Welcome to the 
Singapore business, you have massive leg room, a massive seat, one table that you can adjust the height, one pretty big screen, one, two, three penny size, one cup holder, storage space, a little mirror, plugs, a touchscreen remote control, cabin functions, but no massage, though. no massage. It doesn't go flat. Oh, oh wow. Oh, yeah. Yes, it's flat and it's big. Well, it smells like feet. Cheers. And I hope you guys like the review. I think it's now been settled. We do something I always think that we should do. Oh, and then I can do this. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, <laughs> I think it's now been settled. It's the, the best. <laughs> the world's best business class is with Singapore Airlines. Yes. The amount of movies, I didn't watch any movies, but the amount of movies they had, <laughs> it's insane. Like, yeah, I'm more interested in how the bed was. It's the first flight that I take and I get off and my back feels better than it did when I got on it. Yeah. So, and if you ever have the opportunity to choose airlines, Singapore Airlines kills. Or what do you say, Yanni? Yeah. Oh, it was so nice because I was asking about vegetarian food, and oh. then after they, they got me a vegetarian food, and then the guy was like, So, what's your next flight? <laughs> so, he called the other flight and no. told them, and then he was like, So, I also booked you vegetarian on your way back. But what? So, cute. so, best in every single way. So, we've arrived in Singapore, and oh, now we should probably. Sky train to Terminal 2. Ooh. Yeah, we gotta run. Okay. Uh, because we have 45 minutes, so let's hope we make it. Uh, 53. Picking up descent over the north of oh. Bali of... We made it! Uh, Morning coffee. Morning coffee. Can I introduce you to my team of cabin crew? Please ensure... Can I have the first one? Yes, sir. 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 Yes,
as you noticed, we tried this week of splitting the episode in two. Let us know what you think of that. Um, yes. For us, it's either way, but up to you guys. But now, now we're gonna enjoy this. Yes. this. We were just gonna go for a quick little surf. Turned out to be a little longer surf than usual, but we didn't. We only bought the GoPro, and then we were watching the sunrise sunset. That was even better. And I, and I came home, and I'm like, "Yana, did you grab some photos?" She's like, "Yeah, I got some sick ones." Looked. Because I'm having a new camera, so I forgot about the. Uh, the memory. So you had no memory, memory card. She pulled the yawn. But at least I got to see it. It was beautiful. Yeah. It's been so the it's most in my brain. incredible. Like I was on the boat, and I was like, "Why didn't I bring a camera?" Because <laughs> these two... But you have a camera. Oh, that's yeah, we didn't bring weird. it on. But never put Benny and Jakob in the water at the same time because they will never get out. We had to take the boat and like, <laughs> hello boys. <laughs> right? <laughs> we should organize two boats next time. <laughs> one for normal one people uh, and one for extra special people. But I say that with this view, we are gonna um, end this vlog part two. So let us yeah. know if we should put it all in once or if we split, split it in uh, two halves. Yes. We will be back with more adventures and you know, sure we love thing. this place. Now Bamba. Now Bamba, yeah. tofu buns and sweet potato fries. Fries? <laughs> fries. <laughs> fries, the fries. The fries of this, the best sweet potato fries. The fries is the fries. And okay, so, oh. Oh, that was a nice ending, but... It'll be hard to grade to make it better. Yeah. So I'm saying, Jakob, you have it all figured out. Good night, guys. Not a bad way to uh, end the, the first day here. See you guys soon. See you. Sampai umpa. Sampai umpa.